Welcome back everyone, this is Victor Campos and we're continuing with our HTML5 project. So if we take a look at, uh, at the example project, if we compare it, our example project has all of these screens for classes and such. If you go to the computer screen you see more content and then if you're on the home screen you see a pop-up button for more info on the college and then you can go check out directions to find uh, to get step-by-step -step directions to get to the college. Now our example has all of those pages home, art, computers, etc. and computers which of course you can fill this out on your own and on the home page we've got the pop-up. So our next step is to get our directions our geolocation set up. So the way we're gonna do this is we have a starting point. Uh, we have a starting file you'll need to go to Blackboard, log into Blackboard, and in the Week 4 folder, Week 4, you will have your starting point for geolocation. This is a file that you need to save, so you can right-click and save. Save this starting point file, and we'll see what's in it in a moment. But you want to save it. Mine was saved to the desktop. It's this file called dir.html and that file we need to put into our project which is my mobile website project so I'm gonna drag that in move it so now our dir file our directions file our geolocation file is in them is in the folder of our project so that means we can open up our index and uh, connect the two. So I'm in my index.html file and I need to find the spot where I've got that info button and here it is line 61 that's our button for information. At the moment our href points over to our info screen which is down at the very bottom of our project Div data role page ID info. Here we go. So here's the here's the pop-up box. We want a new button so that the dir file opens up. So after our text here, I'm gonna have directions. This is line 232. That'll be an A tag. It's a, gonna be a link. A href equals quote end quote. Where are we pointing to? We're pointing to dir.html. Now this is different than what we've done throughout the whole project. Every other link has been a an internal link, so to speak. It's been a page that has existed within this one index.html file. Just as a contrast, I'm showing you here that you can link to external content just like before href equals and then the name of the URL but here's the big difference now because it's not an internal page it's an external page so we need to add rel equals quote unquote external notice this is unique it does not say data rel it simply says rel relationship external just to see if this is working I'm going to save it and open and refresh my project click the info button I've got directions there which will make look nicer in a moment but if I click it goes to the directions now spoiler alert don't want to show too much of that just yet I want to continue to fix up my button so very important for you to have the rel external because we are linking to an external HTML file so that this looks more button-esque, we need data role um, button. And now when we load it up, it looks like a button. That of course can be styled with different data themes or icons and all of that, but I'm fine for the moment. So check out our next video where I explain what did we just link to? What is this directions file? So check that out on the next video.